So in this problem, what we're going to do is convert from 6 feet 1 inches into meters. And the way we're going to do that is by using conversion factors. And so you need to know a few conversion factors to actually do it. So you need to know that 1 meter is equal to 39.37 inches. So they give this to you. And so you also need to know how many feet are in an inch, or sorry, how many inches are there per foot. So there's 12 inches for every single foot. So these are going to be the conversions. And so what we want to do first is notice what we have. We have two units. We have feet and inches. And then we want to convert from meters. So what we're going to do is convert this value into one unit. So we're going to make it solely inches. And then we know how many inches there are for a meter. And we can just convert into meters. So first off, let's find how many inches there are in, or how many inches, six foot, one inches. So we know the inch, right? There's one inch. But how many uh, inches are there in six feet? So we know we have six feet. And we want to convert into inches. So the way we do that is by using this conversion factor because it goes from feet into inches. So we know that there are one, there's one foot for every 12 inches. So if we write it like this, notice the feet will cancel. And if you just multiply across, it'll give you the correct unit, which, uh, which is inches. So six times uh, 12 is just going to be 72. So it's going to be 72 inches. So we know there's 72 inches in six foot, but this is six foot one. So we have to add the one inch. So if we add one, it's going to be equal to 73 inches. And so now we have it in one unit. So what we can do is just convert to meters. So we're going to do the same thing we did here. But instead of using uh, feet to inches, we're going to use meters to, uh, to inches because we're trying to uh, convert from inches into meters. So 73 inches. We know that there is going to be 39.37 inches for every single one meter. So we write it on the bottom because the inch is on top. And so they're going to cancel. And essentially what you're going to do is just do 73 divided by 39.37. So 73 divided by 39.37. If you go ahead and do that, what you're going to get is it equals 1.854. Uh, yeah, so 1.854, and then this is going to be in meters because that's what we have, and that's what they want us to do. So this is going to be their height in meters, so 1.854 meters, that's going to be your answer, and hopefully you found this useful.